Hello everyone, welcome to another video by Software Junkie. In this video, I'm going to be discussing on the topic of segmentation fault. Now what a segmentation fault is that it's the error caused by the hardware when a program tries to access a location on main memory for which it is not authorized. Now what basically happens is our main memory is divided into several sections and there is a stack of these addressable locations within each section of main memory. So when a program is in running state, there is always a process associated with it. That process is allocated some section of main memory and that process would be able to access only these locations within that section which it has been allocated. So when a program needs extra memory, when it runs out of memory in its own section, Section, then it has to go through the memory management system to ask for extra memory that hey I'm running out of memory here give me another section to work with but what if the program does not go through the memory management system and itself tries to access the memory location outside the section which it has been allocated well then a segmentation fault is generated by the hardware and it just means that the program is not allowed to access the memory location which it is trying to access now let's say that some random process is allocated uh, locations from 201 to 299 this process would be able to use all these locations from 201 to 299 but neither before 201 and nor after 299 it can access only these memory locations and accessing any address outside this range will cause a segmentation fault now let's try to create a segmentation fault programmatically Now as I was saying segmentation fault has something to do with memory location so I will just use a pointer to demonstrate it. Here, I have created an integer and assigned its address to a pointer. Inside the loop, I am first using the pointer to show the actual value to which this pointer is pointing and then afterwards, then I am showing the location to which this pointer is pointing. This will work. Now if I will just increment the address, then what should happen? Now after running certain iterations of the loop, it's giving me an exception here. With this exception actually is that the pointer now is trying to access the memory location which is outside the allocated space for the process. Now as you can see here, the exception that is raised is a status access violation. That means the process is not allowed to access the memory location on Windows environment. This is the name of the exception that is raised when a segmentation fault occurs. Now why does a segmentation fault occur here? It's because of this line. I'm actually incrementing the location to which this pointer is pointing. Now here's an interesting fact. What if I comment out this line? I will again try to compile it and then run it. It will run but it will not give me a segmentation fault this time. And why so? It's because I'm just printing out the address here. I'm not actually dereferencing the address. So the segmentation fault will not occur while just accessing the pointer. A segmentation fault will occur only while dereferencing the pointer. Uh, that is asking the pointer that hey take me to the location to which you are currently pointing to. So the fault is actually in this line where we are trying to go to the location to which the pointer is pointing. 
In this line, we are just using the pointer to show the location to which it is pointing and nothing much. Uh, but in this line, we are accessing the location to which it is pointing. So, so this is the line which is actually causing the segmentation fault in this program. Hope that is clear now. Thanks for watching.